19 people are reportedly injured after a car plowed into pedestrians near a train station in Melbourne, sending people flying everywhere. The white Suzuki SUV appeared to go through a pedestrian crossing outside the city's main Flanders Street station and crashed in the middle of the busy street. Dramatic footage from the scene shows smoke coming out of the vehicle moments after it came to a halt as bystanders on the street ran towards the vehicle. An employee at nearby Walker's Donuts told radio station 3 oh, she heard screams before she saw people flying everywhere. We could hear this noise, as we looked left, we saw this white car, it just mowed everybody down, she said. People are flying everywhere. We heard thump, thump. People are running everywhere. A number of pedestrians were on the ground and images on social media showed the injured being treated by bystanders. Victorian paramedics said 13 people were taken to hospitals, including a preschool-aged child with a head injury. Two more people were being assessed by medics at the scene. However, some reports have put the injured count as high as 19. Another witness, Lachlan Reed, told local media, he has gone straight through the red light at pace and it was bang, bang, bang. It was just one after the other. The incident occurred about 5 p.m. local time, 6 a.m. GMT, during the evening rush hour. One witness said the vehicle had crashed into a tram stop. Elton Hindley told the Herald Sun a man pulled from the car appeared to be unconscious. It wasn't clear if the driver was hitting them on purpose or not, he said. It sounded like the man who they took out of the car was not awake. He hit the people then crashed into the tram area in the middle of the road. Victoria police said a vehicle had collided with a number of pedestrians. Heavily armed police responded and two people, including the suspected driver, were arrested at the scene, according to the Herald Sun. Police said, police are currently attending an incident on Flinders Street between Elizabeth and Swanston Streets where a vehicle has collided with a number of pedestrians. Police have arrested the driver of the car. Extent of injuries are not known at this stage. Police are asking any witnesses to go to the Melbourne West Police Station at 313 Spencer Street, Melbourne and all vehicular and pedestrian traffic to avoid the area. Hundreds of people were seen milling around the vehicle after it crashed. The extent of injuries to those hurt is unknown at this stage and people were advised to avoid the area. Another witness, Will, said on Twitter, a car drove down the tram tracks and accelerated into pedestrians according to witnesses. Driver has been arrested. Ambulance Victoria tweeted, paramedics have now transported 13 people to city hospitals. Two more people are being assessed by paramedics at the scene. Mike Lee tweeted an image from the scene adding, massive incident, accident at the corner of Flinders Street and Elizabeth Street. Ambulance and emergency vehicles rushing to site. Hard to establish what happened. All happening quickly. Melbourne. Another witness Lauren tweeted, Something just happened outside Elizabeth St. Tram stop outside Flanders Street Station. Avoid area if you can. I saw PPL screaming and smoke. The incident happened in Melbourne's city centre which is packed with workers and tourists. Another witness in the area added, something big happening in Melbourne CBD. Not sure what. Police cars, helicopter, fire engine, Flanders Street closed between Swanston and Elizabeth. Paramedics said three people were taken to the Alfred Hospital. Three people were taken to the Royal Melbourne Hospital. The child was taken to Royal Children's Hospital in a serious condition.